Milwaukee, 24 hour copy. I'm 23 on scene. We got eyes on the yellow vehicle. It's backing up in traffic. No, I don't got a pulse. Looks like he's been hit over the head and ran over. I tried CPR and all that, but I think there's too much damage to be able to come back from it. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to DOJ. Jumping in here with the San Andreas Highway Patrol in the Ford Crown Victoria. We are pretty much all set up and good to go, so we're going to go ahead and leave the station. 10-8 in the CAD. Got my radar all set up. This is going to be interesting. I have a selection of SUVs, obviously, I could have chose from, but I was really in the mood for some type of sedan. Nothing that was too crazy, um, and I don't think this should be sliding out too much. Obviously, this thing likes to just get loose, but it shouldn't really be too bad. We got some uh, radio transmissions coming in. I mean, it's pretty bad when I try to slam on the gas, but if I'm not slamming on it, we should be good. You want to open it? No? Okay. Appreciate it, bud. Appreciate it. Nice and smooth. One day we'll get it so you actually do your job, all right? Cool. I'm going to have to check uh, just to see how good or bad this vehicle actually is going down this little hill, hill here. No, it's not too bad. We should be able to handle it, no problem. And this, this thing, this kind of car, this car in the rain is absolutely horrendous. Um, but I'm sure snow would be probably even worse, but not so much in this game. Um, it kind of tones it back a little. I anytime you would like move the wheel just ever so slightly in snow, I'm sure you would just get sliding and slipping absolutely everywhere. It's going to be a nice little um, county patrol right now. So we'll go working down the 15 here, trying to get down to the 13 if people get on the highway at a reasonable rate of speed. Come on, people. Let's work together. I'm going to try to get over here. I'll try to get over again. Oh, yeah. Nice and smooth. Looks like there's a golf cart going a little crazy in Sandy Shores. Yeah, Romeo 32. We just had him fly 72 past. We're attempting to catch up. 72. A golf cart going... Se How does a golf cart end up going 72 miles per hour? That does not even make sense. I don't know where that was at. I think they might have said somewhere about Sandy Shores. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. This person's going dumbass slow. Looks like they just had a 1080 going on, so it's going to be relaxed here for a minute or two, most likely. I'm going to see if I could drive around this area, see if I could locate possibly anyone matching that description. Who's going to be on a golf cart? 13 to Union. So it's going to be down one exit, actually. So I should probably go down one. Looks like that's where most of the stuff is going on. Uh, crossed over 13 to Union. I'm going to try to help him out. 75 on a golf cart. So it looks like he's actively evading the police on a golf cart. Uh, right now, they have no eyes on the individual, which is interesting. You wonder how the golf cart could actually manage to get away from a, you know, cruiser. Southbound Grapeseed. So we'll keep our eyes out for that just to see if it's anything that we possibly come up with. Um, you know, if he's evading the police and he was going lights and sirens, then obviously that's an issue because this guy is trying to run. So we're going to keep our eyes out if they don't happen to pick him up. Maybe he'll come back onto the highway. It just became nighttime, so it's going to be the cover of nighttime pretty much on his side for maybe another like 10 or 15 minutes. So we'll see what we can pick up here. I'm not sure if this guy needs help. He just honked in the most aggressive manner ever. So I'm going to turn around just to back him up until... Are um, you going to be on a cell phone with that golf cart? Maybe he needs backup. Maybe he doesn't. I'm going to turn around just to double check here. Simple. He might need it for uh, jurisdiction too. Should be Yeah, okay. I knew it. Standby one guy. I think this is going to be the standby. Standby two. Hey, how's it going? What's up? Uh, 
about to call for a 32. I need to, I need you guys out here. Um, I, ha I haven't locked on the radar at 63 on Panorama. He just decided to come out here as I was running lights and centers. Um, I caught up to him and then he Temple. attempted or he flipped the Yui on the highway. And then he went over here in the deserts and then he decided to come back out to the road and then he could find a stop for me. Okay. Yeah, well, have a chat with him, see what's up. Okay, looks like this guy was speeding, somehow ended up in the middle of absolutely nowhere. So hopefully he doesn't try to take off yet again. No, I can't even hear the guy. Sure. Well, my bad. I, I put or it female. I put, <laughs> I put it was a 60. Gal. Um, can't even hear the bad. gal. Do you have a driver's license, proof of insurance, and registration for me? <laughs> yeah, here you go, man. So she must That's have not heard bad. the That's siren. Could be possible with the helmet. Just sit tight I'll, I'll um, you know, if you're going crazy throughout the hills and stuff like that, then I guess it could be a little more difficult. Okay, sounds good. I think everything should be pretty clear with this. I know one of the officers was looking for a motorcycle. This is probably the guy that was looking for the motorcycle. We had another one looking for a golf cart. Uh, I believe that one's still outstanding. So, but that one was actually actively evading. Uh, this female here was not. So nothing too serious going on here. For jurisdictional purposes, we're going to hang out and make sure everything goes smooth with the traffic stop. And then we'll take back off on the road heading southbound. I knew that that honk wasn't like, hey, how you doing? You know what I mean? It was the, hey, stop right now. <laughs> it was the, hey, stop. Um, so I was like, oh, shit, we'll probably just do a U-turn really quick. Uh, and it was actually a confirm on that. So I'm glad that worked out. I think we got a panic going out. Not sure who or why. We'll see what's going on with this. Postal 247. From a uh, individual, we currently have him at gunpoint. Gonna be 247 USA 68. I think they got him. I was gonna take off, Careful. but I think they might have it under control there. Do require medical out there. Oh, uh, yeah, just in safety. 10 for county medical in route. Yeah, I think they're good. They have one at gunpoint, so. He was struck by a car. I think someone hit a cop with a all car right, or something. Here you go. Here's all your information back. Um, Thank you. Who knows what goes on in the city anymore? Yes, uh, Four one two. I'm gonna be on a ten eleven. G O H. Uh, nearest local zero three two. Four door truck with a Patriot eight. I have a thirty two. Five double three eight. It also carries a two hundred and thirty four dollar fine. Uh, you have to take care of this fine. If you choose to fight in court, your court is yeah, 30 days from now, uh, which would be... You yeah, know, I thought it was pretty, uh, I thought it was pretty true of you, dude. Like, I can, I've got, like, pretty much no history on my record. Never, and, like, give me a citation. I am actually quite disappointed. <laughs> quite disappointed you gave me a citi citation. citation for speeding. So there it is. Okay, well, I'm disappointed you're speeding, so I guess it's... There you go. Yes, it worked. Well, I said, I said you can give me a ticket if you really wanted to. Like, and he did. So why are you complaining? Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Because I didn't need anything. You were going to be an asshole. Go up and give me a fucking well, ticket. Well, then don't so say, I'm okay, okay, okay if you give me a ticket. I didn't realize it was a 50. I genuinely thought it was a 60. And you also didn't realize you were going to get a ticket after saying, okay, give me a ticket. So uh, you learn something new every day. Okay. Uh, I currently don't. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Yeah, whatever. If you can also, uh, oh boy. Oh shit. Yeah, oh, that's right. You better listen. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> yeah, like like a cop's just gonna ki kick you. You're welcome. Like a cop is just gonna kick a suspect. Like, come on. What does this look like? I'm pulling out. That was a little jank. I think that might have been a person. Oh, he's good. Oh no. He, he turned his lights on and stopped that person. Yeah, that was interesting. Wasn't really sure why she was being that way. How are you going to tell the cop, okay, give me a ticket, and then when they come back and give you a ticket, 
It's like, oh, hell no. You did not just take it me. It's like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. They did. Because you just said that. Like, Jesus. Uh, 070. That has to be up in Polito. Oh, actually. that That's the one on, uh... Oh, I thought they didn't stop, bro. I was like, you're an idiot. But they did. Uh, no, that's the 070 on 15. So that's kind of the direction we're going. But I want to check a little bit of Route 68 since it's daytime now. I don't even think this... Damn. Just took out three of those water barrels. I don't even think Dispatch knew I was on a traffic stop with that guy or assisting. I'm not even sure if he radioed it in. He just kind of did his thing and then was like, Oh yeah, I need backup. Send me backup. <laughs> it's like, okay. Not even send me backup. Honked his horn three times and I somehow knew what he was trying to tell me. Got to love it. Oh, that was a little sketchy, bro. Charles Jr. I'm having a heavy Damn. This two. guy. The motel. Okay. That was... I don't know if I want to flip around on that. That was pretty aggressive, and I think he knows it. He was going relatively fast. So, that was unsafe speed for conditions. I'm not sure why he's flipping uh, or passing cars up like that. Oh, boy. Okay, he did it right at that sign. Let's go ahead and see where that stuff stops oh yeah he passed someone in a no pass zone right there he's really got to pay attention to those markers I know it's hard to see but you got to pay attention three Charles two three nine I'm gonna have one vehicle ferry to yield uh, we're gonna be east on Joshua Road 275. Heavy 1050 rollover. What is he doing? Stand by. Heavy 1050 rollover. Uh, one Go ahead. One King 24 K here, right there, Vaughn comes over by. Type 271. One King 24 and Route Code 3. I don't know why that guy moved, like. Should have just stayed there. Okay, back in the back in the uh, vehicle. Subjects taking off from the police right here. Okay, we got one at gunpoint. One K twenty four. Be advised, it was a dune buggy as well that was uh, last seen. Another one caller stated for that shot fired. Walking 24 hour copy. I'm a 23 on scene. We got eyes on the yellow vehicle. It's backing up in traffic right now. Roger, last call. Go ahead. What do you want to do Three here? Eight, show me on 10, in a red Porsche I'm car. not really sure. You just Two really door, to seven, Yeah, nine, I'm not sure either. Got a jacket, 29. I mean, 28. We're ready. Uh, we got to see to stop okay, him. I mean, driver, yeah, stop your vehicle. Nah, Don't go up that. Bravo, bravo. You son of a bitch. <laughs> you son of a... Get down. Get down. No. Get down right now. No. You better get down from there. No. Get down. Roger, no. Now. No. You get no. down right now. No. Right now. No. <laughs> right can't. now. What's in it for me, man? Just get off the billboard. You're just gonna be fine. I'm, I'm not gonna tase you. I'm not gonna touch you. I want you off the billboard because you're gonna get hurt. And we don't want that, right? I'd, I'd rather be six feet deep than. Well, if you fall off the billboard into the snow, you will be six feet deep into the snow. Yeah, I'd rather be that than with you down there, man. And, your and you will survive. That will not kill you in the snow. What if I just shoot myself and then my dead body falls on you, Go man? Ahead, sir. That'd be kind of funny. Go ahead and run. One in a million shot. One Do me a favor. Let's talk down ahead. here so I don't have to strain my voice yelling no. up at you. Oh, no, man. Roger, be advised. It's going to be counting. What, what were you? What's what's going on here? Why are you driving backwards down the road? Why are you on the billboard? Why aren't you home? Because I crashed. Be I, I live in Grapesea, man. Okay, so why are you I'm here? I'm so sick and tired of because I'm not here for business, man. I gotta make money. 
flat out the four Okay, well, come down and make money. How are you going to make money from up there? How am I going to make money from a jail cell? It'll be a, you'll be in and out by the night. I don't think so, man. I'm pretty I, sure you would be. I hurt people. I hurt people. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, but you can tell me all about it if you come I, down. Man. <laughs> I'm trying my hardest here. Actually kind of convincing. No, man. <laughs> there it is. I mean, like I said, I'm all ears, but Go I can't do it if you have to shout at me. What is going to happen if I come down there, man? And don't lie to me. I'm not going to lie to you. I won't taser you. Nothing. I'll just, I'll put the cuffs in the front. You'll sit in the front seat of the cruiser. You'll tell a cop all about it. And everything will be good. There's no, there's no need for you to get hurt. How long am I going to jail for? I have no and idea what they want for you. I'm a backup unit, so I really have no idea, honestly. Um, that could be easily figured out, but I'd rather tell you why you're down here. Right, thank you. To my knowledge, if you just backed up in traffic and they told you to stop, in and out by the end of the night. That's not what happened at all, man. Just gonna be completely frank with you. Well, that's all I saw, so. I've done a lot of things. Mark's on you, Route 13. I've done a lot. Mile marker one. It's gonna be a black and color. So what are you gonna do? You wanna come down? We can talk about it. We got a lot of commotion starting down here. We don't need any other people getting in accidents. Hey, for me, we're supposed to 126. We'll be cut forward with one. Right, for the cut forward one. Uh, one two six. Just open up the road, man. Eight. Everything's good up here. I think we're all. You know, I can't open uh, up the road. We're all right, crystal, crystal, crystal clear, as they say. Well, let's get down here. That way, we can hear each other crystal clear. Three stand by one. Uh, Union fifty two. Man. I like how your voice carries up here, though. <laughs> there it is. Control Union 5 -2. Come on. Come on Part down the ladder. Let's just, uh, Parker. no one needs to get tasered. I got smokes hey. in the car. I'll give you a smoke. Yeah, like I said, your hands, if you cooperate and we don't just sit here going back and forth for the next five minutes, I already said your hands are going to be in the front of you, so you'll clearly be able to smoke a cigarette. And then after All that, right. handcuffs got to go behind you. I think How that's many fair. Calls do I get? That's at the jail, and that would be one. All right. All right. So come on down. We'll talk oh, down here. I'm so sore. Well, I oh. bet you just got into an accident. Lucky 24, we got one coming down the billboard. Okay, step over here with these guys. They're gonna put some cuffs no, on you, make sure you don't have any slowly. weapons. Just, just let me breathe for a minute before you get close, okay? Go ahead, sir. Well, do me a favor, step yeah, over with these guys. I'm glad we got you off the billboard. Alright. I'll block the uh, stairs if you guys wanna. Well, we got him off the billboard. Hey, stop walking and cooperate. I was, I was, cle I was cool with you. You be cool with me. Yeah, but let's just keep our personal distance for a minute, man. God damn ladder. If he comes back... This fucking ladder. <laughs> this fucking ladder. Man. Man. Come on, man. You gotta cooperate with him. I don't know what they need or want, or what your original arrest is, but... You need to co- Oh, Alright, why are my handcuffs in the back? Oh... I think you got bigger issues than the handcuffs behind your back, my guy. <laughs> I think they're hypothetically in the front, so you don't have to worry about that. Just, we'll patch you down for weapons. You said you had a gun, right? Yeah, I got a gun. Okay, have you shot it today, or what's going on? Why are... Okay. I don't know what that was supposed to be. What else do you guys have them for, or is it just that? Uh, I was just gonna question him about the, the shots, because he left you know, kind of in a hurry after the gunshot stopped, and, you know, if he's sitting here now saying it wasn't him, then he just pretty much ran from us for no reason. Okay. And still, got, and still catching the charge. Alright. So what were you gonna do on the billboard? I... I wanted some kind of leverage, man, because you guys are always on some BS. Well, you already said you were going to shoot yourself as well, too, so... Well... 
I want to die, man. I do. Okay. Well, saying stuff like that, we're going to make sure we get you help then. Yeah. Okay. You also are going to be charged for the crimes, but you will get help. Make sure we're clear here. Let me sit in my car to get these speeds of these trucks. Forty-eight. Sixty-nine. Sixty-nine. Sixty-nine on the sports car. Damn! Walking 24, 10, 11, and a 32 at 300. Not my eyes! Not my eyes! Oh, okay. Not my eyes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's for a group of vehicles. Disregard that 32. I got a vehicle pulling over. It's going to be a 10, 11. Roger, thank you for going to East Joshua Road on a 10 11. Thank you, 1924. If you can just get the upper unit to advise. There's no one with me. I needed a 32 because I thought it was a multi vehicle accident. Looks like it was a 22 situation. Roger, this is advise me at the same guy's code for. Oh, man, can we hurry this the fuck up? I gotta get somewhere. Okay, we're gonna stop this guy. I'm not really sure what the dispatcher said there at all in any way, shape, or form, honestly. How you doing? Uh, I've been doing better, man. What's up? Oh, that's good. Um, I stopped you for your speed. Are you catching up to those guys? What are you doing? I need your... you want to hand me your info while you're I'm telling me? I'm trying to get around them. They're all going slow. Okay, well, when I got your speed, you were pretty far back still catching up to them, so... You were going 69, so you were speeding to keep. But how does that make sense? I, I got somewhere to be, man. Okay. All right. Just, my wife just had a. My girlfriend just had a kid. It's not mine. I'm gonna go beat the shit out of him. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Just do me a favor. Sit tight. I'm gonna run your info. All right. Yeah, he said he was trying to catch up to... Well, he said he was trying... He's got somewhere to be. And he also said he was trying to pass those guys because they were going slow. But my question is, how are you passing those guys if they're going slow if you were still trying to catch up but you were speeding? So I don't know if that really makes any sense. That's not it. At all, honestly. No revoke, no suspended. Coming back to a comet going to be a 91 BB. Go ahead. No warnings, no citations. Do we have any active traffic units to conduct a field sobriety test and investigations for... Vehicles coming back super clean as well, too. Okay, well, I'm going to give him a uh, quick citation. We'll get him out of here since he does have somewhere he need to be, but we obviously have to give him a citation for the speed. It's not really making too much sense. Um, you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to cut him a break. We're going to give him unsafe speed for conditions since he has somewhere to be, he said. It seems like a legitimate excuse. Um, it wasn't too crazy of a speed. So we'll go ahead and uh, drop it down out of a speeding ticket. Joshua Road, eastbound. Roger, can I get you to activate his investigation if possible? Oh, that guy on the bike Never. smashing. How did that cop not... Alright, so it's gonna... I'm gonna catch you a break today. Instead of giving you a speeding violation, I'm gonna give you unsafe speed for conditions. So, do me a favor, sign the bottom of the citation. It's not a mission to go. It's saying you're take care of the court. Thanks, man. Okay. There's your info back along with your license. Just go ahead and pull out into traffic safely, alright? Alright, man. Thank you. Yep. Have a good one. Get a call later about me beating someone's ass. <laughs> Mind your business. Okay, good. Ten four. What? That's like the third car that's went super fast down the road. He's also excelled over 80 miles per hour. We're gonna head back down towards um, the freeway here because all these cars are speeding. One K 24 10 11s would be code four back to name. Looking for a machine gun round. 
Okay, one of the cars ducked off left. I think the rest of them went straight towards the highway. Oh, come on, bro, really? People go so slow, it's hard to get caught up to people because you can't dip and dive around people like you would think. Let's see, it looks like the individuals are going over the freeway. They're stopping at stop signs. Everything looks good on that front. So we're gonna go ahead and just make sure we double check these freeways that they're stopping at stop signs and stuff. And uh, if everything looks good, we'll probably just find a speed radar location and let everyone go about their day if they're driving safe. This is jank. How am I supposed to go in there if This is sketchy. Okay, he's stopping. Everything's good. I'm still going to go northbound on the freeway. There we go. That was sketchy, but we made it. We made it. 235 East Joshua Road. That's where we were just at. We were somewhere by there, somewhere on Joshua, and I guess there's another accident. The snow is deadly today. So right now there's a vehicle, four vehicles, those trucks that we saw earlier, that I was going to try to get the speed on, but we never actually got them. Good. Yeah, we're going to try to get down to West Joshua. I think we got four people leaving some type of... Uh, be advised, come here, Joshua, sorry, my apologies, Joshua Road, nearest post was 233, there were four pickup trucks involved in this incident, couldn't get you en route, uh, currently there's two officers on the scene. 233, so we're going the right direction, but it's going to take us a minute. Monkey 24 en route. We'll see what we can get here. I'm going to try to see if we can locate the pickup trucks. We got two officers on scene, I'm going to try to see if we can go for the vehicles here. I'm gonna go code two. That was a little close. Oh, east now. That's that's westbound. Monkey twenty four two three C eighty. Is that westbound to sixty eight? Ten four three. More cars going that way. Okay. Monkey twenty four. I got the trucks right here. It's gonna be a green and. Uh, I'm going to be making a traffic stop on him. Can I get more units to 241, please? Roger 241. Free Charlie, 239. Go ahead. Can I get you route 241 now? Uh, route 68, please. Alright. Can I talk to some of you, please? What y'all doing today? You guys uh, with another truck? Be advised, it's still on the scene with the billboard. Uh, oh, I mean, there's like three trucks. No, the one that's back there on a traffic stop road. somewhere. Or Roger, oh, yeah, my whole you, you, anyway. you guys with him oh, or no? Yes. Oh, you guys are, but he's a jackass. Okay, good. Um, so we got, we're getting reports of uh, some type of altercation or incident in the vehicles. Can you explain what happened back there? Okay, did you get into an accident or? No, no, he just rolled his own car on the hill. Not confirmed. Okay. He didn't hit anything, didn't damage nothing, just damaged his own vehicle. And that was your buddy in the truck, right? Uh, oh, him. Uh, okay, so I'm trying to figure yeah, out. The guy that got pulled over was, wasn't doing anything. Okay, hold on one sec. Uh, it was an accident on the side of the road, and they decided they, they didn't need a police officer, they could handle it themselves, and wanted to leave. Uh, the guy that flagged me down is in my car at 232, and uh, they're trying to leave. Monkey 24 to 3C80, so do you want us to just disregard these gentlemen? If they're saying that they don't need any help anymore, then probably so. They just took off. Uh, when I told them that to stay still, and they all took off, so that's why I pulled over the guy that flagged me down. Ten four, I'm gonna let them go then, since they said they're refusing medical attention. Ten four. Okay, you guys are good. My guy wanted to make sure that you guys were good, since you guys just walked off. He said sit tight for a second. He wanted to make sure you guys didn't have any 
gaping wounds or anything, so. Oh yeah, he had said sit tight, so that's why we had rolled back up. Okay, well, everything's good here, so as long as you guys are good, just to be clear, you guys are refusing medical attention, right? Alright, y'all have a great day. Hey, did they let, let our friend go, or did they find his cocaine? Uh, I have no idea. <laughs> Shut up! Oh, shit, it's Frank. Okay, so we're gonna take off from here. Appreciate it, guys. Uh, that was a false call. Monkey 24, I'm be 10 available for calls. Roger, Monkey 24. Uh, currently, the my only unit on the board that's responding. Can I get you in route 100 on Great Ocean Highway? I'll be advised, it's just for an NBA with injury. Uh, oh! Management for now. 10 far, I'll be in route. So, we've got a uh, traffic management call coming out. 330. Um, we're gonna help with some traffic assessment. Uh, uh, assessment? I don't know what that means. We're gonna help with some traffic assistance. Uh, I'm the only one available on the board, so we're gonna go ahead and take it and try to help out where we can. Looks like we're gonna have to go upwards to two and a half miles. Postal 100's close to... Polito. So I'm not sure how far up that is. It looks like they're sending out some more units to that. So we're gonna go ahead and help with some traffic uh, where it's needed. We don't really have a code 3 response, I don't think. I'm not exactly sure the nature of the call. I believe it's just a motor vehicle accident. Um, I believe they have officers on scene though. I'm sorry, sir. You did the 52 through me counting. So if they have officers on scene, I really don't need to be responding code 3. If they don't, I probably Somewhere should get out there. Control watch. I'm gonna let him know. Control just went out of channel. Once he gets back in here, we'll go ahead and ask for information. We'll stay at a, like a code 2 response right now. No siren. Uh, Three Charlie 290 did five county medical in route EK five mine. Walkie 24, is there officers on scene of postal 100? A firm, one time officer, Free Charlie 90 is on scene with um, one time occupant in a vehicle. Now, for I'm gonna upgrade to code 3 to get there a little faster. I think I got the other cop that's going out Control with me to the MBA right behind me. And uh, we're going to both be able to get there pretty quick now. I think it's just one officer that's on scene with a MBA uh, individual right now. Oh, it's going to be right at Union Road. That's not even that bad. Yeah, it's going to be right there. I think I see him. Oh, shit. It's going down. Okay. Hey, are we on traffic, right? Yeah. I think okay, we are. Yep. so I say I clear the crap and then Five we the block we that stop. highway okay. where all the traffic's growing. Alright, sounds good. Alright, let me get what to my thing. Okay. Okay, that should give him some breathing room. At least for right the second. Yeah, that should be good. And then hopefully all the other traffic over there will do the thing. Get my vest on, so that way I don't get pummeled by traffic, even though I most likely will get pummeled by traffic. Relax, everyone calm down, please. Lucky 24, I'm gonna be 23 on scene. We have traffic control. 
Cruiser 1 King 24 on scene with top control, thank you. Cruiser 434 control. 434. I just had a red Christmas livery vehicle wearing a Christmas horn go down westbound down. Yeah, east traffic was getting horrible. Rate. It's it's pretty bad right now, honestly. Um, but it was getting to the point of like no return there for a minute. Can you just and it was all on again? top of them, but at least they have some breathing room. Obviously, there's still traffic over there. It happens. It is what it is. But literally 99.9% .9 uh, of the traffic is blocked behind our cars. I've got to save my uh, car. I have not done that the whole time, but surprisingly it hasn't disappeared or anything. Uh, heading westbound high rate of speed from 282 East Joshua Road. Rotor 282 East Joshua Road. Uh, have you managed to clock a speed? Negative 30 blue, blue pass be seen at a very high rate of speed. Oh my god. Was that him? Fuck. Uh, I'll take traffic control. One King 24. One King 24. I got the vehicle. We're going to be southbound Union Road. He just blew through our traffic control we had. Where the one King 24? Do you need additional units for that? Yeah, he's failure to yield. We're going to be westbound Grapeseed Avenue, postal 101. It's, one. it's going to be a silver semi truck cab. Okay, so right, I don't know, is it? Walkie 24, just to confirm, it's a silver truck, right? Negative, sir, it's a Christmas style vehicle. Okay, 10 4, this might be unrelated. He, 10 4. This guy almost killed 19 people. I'm going to see if I can stop him. So are you going to continue with the uh, traffic stop on the vehicle? Yeah, we're stopped here at 091 on the silver trailer list cab. Where is 091? Would you like an additional 52 to your location? Negative, I'm clear. Thanks. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get a citation on this guy. Obviously, excuse me. Obviously, it wasn't a real person, but the way that they blew through the traffic like that was so deadly, dude. It was scary. I thought that was him. I was like, oh, yeah, there he is. He just froggered through the freeway system right there. Uh, but no, that wasn't even him. Surprisingly, I don't even understand how that was possible, but okay, that works for me. We're gonna get this guy out of here with the citation. I'm doing two emotes on top of emotes right now. There we go. All right, you better slow it down, dude. I'll take your ass to jail next time. Oh, you almost hit my car. Oh my god, you know how shitty that would have been? Slow it down. Don't do that as he backs into my fucking car. Wow. All right, I'm gonna turn around and get back to that scene to try to help them out there. I don't know if they're going to need it, uh, but that traffic was pretty bad, so I don't want it to get even worse because of me pulling away thinking that was a real person. But I was on him, that's for sure. Okay, we're rolling back up to scene here. There is a million semi-trucks, it seems like. I'm not sure what's up with that. Seems like it's getting pretty bad, honestly. They got traffic stopped. Yeah, I guess that wasn't even a real person, so that's cool. That's that's AR for you right there. Yeah, it looked like it was real. You're good to clear off. They wanted to, uh... 
You wanted to open up the outside lane, so you're good to clear off if you want. Okay, I'll take off then. I appreciate it. Get out of the way. Yep, no problem. You have a good one. Thanks. All right, we're gonna take off. They said we're good from here. They mostly got uh, everything taken away, anyways. So we're just gonna be code four ten eight, and then just be looking around, see if there's anything else that we can get into or pick up that's going on. Cars are acting very weird. What the hell? You good, bro? Oh no, he is. He is not good. He is not good at all. He was in his car. He was on the right side of his car, stuck in the passenger side. Poor guy, dude. I'm going to go down a exit, just to see what else we got going on. That was interesting, though. We got one running. Walkie 24, what's your location? I'll head that way. 066, heading east towards uh, Alamo Street, or not Alamo Street, towards the sea. Walking 24, if there's any other unit in Polito or near that area, if you could respond code 3, you guys might be closer. Suspects would be a Whiskey Mike, wearing all black, heading towards Polito, 037 now. Okay, so we've got one suspect, 037066. Walkie 24, is there any other units in Polito or on the highway system near it? We got a far way to go to be able to get out there. I'm not sure if he's going to be able to catch up to him. I'll try to get out there and help. But I'm... I'm I got a three and a half mile... Frickin' uh, route that I'd have to take to get out there. GOH, yeah. I mean, if he still got tabs on him, then we should be able to get out there in enough time. It's going to be a little sketchy, but we should be good. I'm going to turn this into a pursuit version so that way we get a little faster. I don't think it is the pursuit where version. Here, this farm, uh, I know exactly where they're at. Walkie 24, just try to keep up uh, eyes on them and positions. We'll be out there soon. Let's see if we can help this guy out. Behind the station. I think gas station maybe? If that's the case, we're going to roll up right on that sure, side. Yeah. Walkie 24, we got three. I think we should be good unless you're close by. Negative. Alright, we're in the wrong station now, heading uh, towards Polito. Towards Polito, so I think it's uh, literally a cop. Yeah, he just, he's just arriving. He's gonna get that shit. Come on, dude, you got it. So it's a cop, I think, chasing a suspect, right, not a cop in a car. Okay, he's gonna be in Polito now. Come on, we're going 126. We'll be there in maybe two minutes. One at gunpoint. How many are there? Okay, we're still good. Maybe in about a minute. Running north of GOA to Polito Boulevard. Still going to Polito Boulevard. He had him at gunpoint, but he took back off. He said, fuck that. We're almost there, baby. Come on. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. We're going to be able to help out. There's this cruiser. There's this other cruiser. We got one time to pay 041 in the alleyway. We got uh, hands up. Off of Polito Boulevard. An alleyway off of Polito. We're gonna be right in here. One ten fifteen. Here. I don't know where they're at. I think they're somewhere in here. Ooh. Oh, nice. I was a run right there. You guys are okay. Yeah, we're good. Okay. I, mean, oh, okay. I randomly <laughs> picked this run, alleyway. You know. Now, do you need medical? Yeah, there was a lot of cops just, here. Holy shit. Left, left. Okay, all right. He just takes back off again in cuffs. That's bullshit, man. Who is hey, that? That, that, <laughs> no, do it. that was a stupid decision. You're that stupid. Very, very stupid. All right. That's why you're being arrested. Yeah, I'm not sure what that was, why they decided to run, or what the issue was. 
ugly ass dick by. with Stand damage by. on the front. Not on my I'm screen. Your mouth shut. I'm the drunk. Uh, not on my side, dumbass. <laughs> there it is. Roger. Three trails to it. Oh, I got all three um, pickups here. Alright, so you are under arrest. Do you have the right to remain well, silent? Like Anything you say or do that. kind of will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right I think to I have a, a yeah, trooper. So his car's. Fuck you. Hey. I'll take that as a yes, thank you. Show me that 1011 with a 243 with a white pickup truck. Oh, rock pickup. Which one's yours? Um, the Tahoe. Oh, behind the car. Yeah, yeah, uh, if you step around. Oh, the one in front? Right, yeah, if you step around. That guy almost hit my car. He did almost hit his car. Go ahead, we sent him Alright, thank you, George. Yep. Romeo, no. no problem. Lima. Watch your head getting up. India. What are we doing? Zero nine nine. Foxtrot. Echo. Roger, I can't spell it. You're a lot of work. Yeah, I try. Yeah, I know. Watch your head getting into this. Three Charlie eighty two one eight. A full background. What's this twenty eight? I don't know what's going on down there, but we're gonna take off go and ahead. go find out. Other than the fan side. All right, we're going over to this new call. Monkey Twenty Four Dispatch, can I get an update on this call that I'm heading out to at zero nine nine or zero zero nine? For the be advised, they have the trucks at zero three nine, but there is a body still at the beach at zero zero nine. Uh, but it sounds that if I can get someone in wraps to down there, it's uh, gonna allocate the unit. Ten Four, you want me to go zero zero nine? Hey, so that'd be great if you can just find the body and uh, got uh, other units with the truck right now. Free Charlie 290. It's currently on speed and there's another unit there as well. Time for you, show me 23 in the area. Okay, so right now we're looking for. A, from what I'm picking up, that's why I wanted an update on the call because I'm not entirely sure. We're looking for a body that I think has been dropped off. Control, uh, we we, we got three trucks, but we don't have any PC at the time, so just gonna clear off. We will stay in the area, but it's not much to go on at the time. Yeah, I was gonna say, how are you gonna correlate whether or not they did something? For the beef eyes, I can call back the mail and call it if need be. I'm in the area, but I'm not sure right, if I'm gonna forth. find anything. Yeah, it's looking relatively quiet. I can check the road, but I'm not seeing a damn soul. I see an ATV close to the water, which is a little odd. Oh shit, I see him. Monkey 24, I'm at 009. I see someone in the water. I'm going to try to get him out. Hey, you awake? You alive? Roger, 1K24, do you need an additional unit? 1K24, you can go in around me. I'm gonna be on the beach, 009. Roger, control to the unit with the uh, plate search of wildlife be advised. Uh, not reported stolen, um, no 1031 Viva. I'll be advised you all clean. Comes back to Jamal Denver. I'm gonna start some CPR. Seems to be water in some time. Okay, so let's start some CPR here. Good Lincoln 330. Be advised 009. Why can't I get closer um, to him? Procopio Promenade. Uh, you're going to be assisting one king 24. He's just currently on the beach. Oh, probably because I am. Out of the water if we can tune route. Well, that's fucking frustrating, dude. Control Romeo 32. There we go. Romeo 32, stand by unless urgent. Uh, just be advised information for that. We do have a pike unit out if you, you need us. Roger, Romeo 32, one king 24, just advise. 
Lucky 24, I got him out of the water. I'm starting CPR now. Just someone down here for safety. Roger, you have uh, one in route. Five Nora one five three. One five three. Can I get a volunteer activation, please, for a medical unit? Uh, all right, I'll be able to activate that one, Mike. Roger, sir. I will create a call up for you. You want me to touch it to your Leo CAD or a fire CAD? You can just attach me and Leo. So I got another unit coming out. I'm working on the individual. I'm trying well, CPR, five, five, trying to get water out of his lungs, uh, also attempting to just get a heartbeat going five. again. Uh, I'm lucky I found four, him. And another unit is on scene at 2 Lincoln 330. Be advised, 009 Procopio Promenade. My units are close. That's why I left the lights on a little easier to see me from afar. Reach out, dude. You can show me back a uh, 10-8 water whiskey giver. To Charles, 239, I'll be back tonight. Roger, back tonight. Back tonight. Can we get the record? I should have a 10 either. Okay, we're going to go ahead and stop CPR since it looks like he's heavily injured. Um, he was probably beat up or something by these guys. Yeah. No, I don't got a pulse. Looks like he's been hit over the head and ran over. I tried CPR and all that, but I think there's too much damage to be able to come back from it. Monkey 24, we can go ahead and start fire medical to 009 for the uh, individual. Looks like he's going to be deceased at this time. Roger, right, so you should have medical uh, rolling up in your scene. Is that actual medical? Oh, yeah, nice. I don't know how we're going to get information then if he's deceased, so. You said he was ran over? Looks like there's a tire mark on his chest. I'm not entirely sure, but that's what it looks like. Alright, what's the deal with this guy? Uh, tried CPR. Um, no luck on that. No pulse. Looks like he has a pretty severe gash to his head, along with a what I believe is a tire mark on his chest. Okay, uh, does his chest look crushed here? When I was doing CPR, it's, I didn't see or feel anything that was abnormal. Okay. Lucky well, 24, uh, can I get a 28, please? Lucky 24, go ahead and do 28. It'll be 21, David, Victor, Adam, 925. Roger, confirming 21, David, Victor, Adam, 925. 10 4 possibly could come back with no record. That's an ASM on that. 10 4, thanks. So, most likely was a stolen ATV from this beach here, which something went down and then he was submerged about two feet in the water when I rolled up. I could hardly see him. If that ATV wouldn't have been there, I would never have found him. Is that ATV stolen? Uh, it's a local probably, most likely was used. It could have been used in the crime, I'm not sure, but it's not coming back to anyone. We'll probably get hit on a or something. ATV's missing or something. Well, how do we correlate those drivers of the trucks having to do something with this? Sorry, what was it? How do we correlate the truck drivers over here to this scene because I heard that the truck drivers were involved and they knew there was a body here so how 
Milwaukee 24 dispatch. How are the uh, truck drivers involved in this 009 call that we have? Be advised, I had a 911 call come for in regard um, to the body. Uh, be advised, uh, it was a 911 AI caller that came through stating that the apparently they ran him over on the street, which is on Prokofio Promenade, and then from there dragged his body down to the ocean area, then came and ran him back over. I can try and initiate a 911 call back if you'd like. So we have an independent witness saying that they saw these trucks run him over? That's an AFM. 10 4, can we put out another bolo for those vehicles then since we have probable cause to be stopping them? Roger, right, sir, I'll put a bolo out for those vehicles. I've controlled those units so that I had them pulled over uh, before just at the fuel station. Please advise me. <laughs> or if you can update it in the shed notepad, uh, just a description, and if possible, a license plate on all those vehicles. How's he looking? Uh, what I got down on the notepad. Roger, thank you very much. Not very good. Um, seems like I can really do anything. I got FE, seeing if there's any electrical activity uh, or anything we can work with, but if the crushed wounds to the chest are too much, um, then probably just gonna have to call him. Okay, is that what you think it is too, that he got ran over? Um, I mean, his ribs look to be crushed, and that could be from the Lucas device here, which is doing the chest compressions. Um, but from the look of things, if you guys have information that he got ran over, um, and I'm not seeing anything uh, electrically, might have to call him here and say. Yeah, we're thinking he, from the poor reports we have, he supposedly got ran over. I'm gonna try uh, one more epi injection, and then if that doesn't work, I'll probably call him. All right. So unfortunately, I don't think the guy's gonna be able to get a resuscitation on this uh, individual. Yeah, it looks like he's a victim of foul play with the trucks that are that were stopped. He didn't have any probable cause at the beginning, but now we have an independent witness stating that this uh, happened. So we'll be able to kind of move forward with the situation a little better. Okay. I'll call for MEO, see if we can have anyone activate. Um, if not, we'll just have county come down here. Alright, I appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. Uh, medic 3, fire control. Medic 3? Do we have any active MEO or anyone able to activate MEO? Stand by. Control to any available MEO advice? I'm going to look for a wallet on him, see if we can get a name or something on this guy, because obviously we're going to have to alert his family about what has happened here once the full medical report and the autopsy and all that comes back, and we'll know exactly. All right, we'll have a county ME owner out for this guy. Should be here pretty soon. Okay, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Anything else you need from me while I'm here? Hey, for no, I think we should be good. I'm gonna try to find out this guy's name. Have any more information they can add it? Alright, wonderful. Roger, thank you very much. Shortly, but I'm gonna clear off, so All right. Back to the station. I appreciate it. You have a good one. I have a bullet coming out. Dude. I have a three times listed truck. They're all gonna have different liveries. One's gonna have a US flag livery. He doesn't have a wallet on him, so we're gonna have to credit. I'm looking through his phone here to try to find his name. Uh, possible hit and run. Be contact, contact. Looks like I'm... Um, he was trying to get an Uber. His name is Julian Bishop. That's the Uber driver's name? Or no, this is his name. He was trying to get an Uber, it looked like. If you want to write that down, maybe run it. Um, Coroner should be out here in a minute.
Oh, you might want to fix your patches too. They're not fully attached to your uniform. Sorry, I'm having technical issues on my No, you're good. Alright, uh, what was his name? His name was... Uh, Julian, J-U-L-I-A-N, Bishop. Awesome. I'll get this one through. Okay, you hear me about your patches, too? Uh, yeah, no, I do. All you have to do is just go under the badges and click 5 or 6 to go over to the next page and it should flatten them out on the uniform. There you go. We have a three trucks here at the Tayshore's airfield gas station. Rota 314, uh, do you need any additional? Yeah, A for this is going to be three of seven, two officers here. If we get one or two more units. Rota 5 Delta 345. Go ahead. And 5 Delta 207. Go ahead. Okay, you want to run the name, check all that, make sure it comes back, and then we'll write, you can write the report up or whatnot. Just say that we found the body. Oh uh, yeah, I write it all up. Um, he got ran over, correct? I mean, they're going to have to do the autopsy, but from what we're seeing, it was, it was a definite assault. So, we, I don't know how, but he was assaulted. We have an eyewitness uh, for the truck drivers. They have them stopped right now, or they're going to have them stopped at the airfield. So we'll have our suspects here shortly. Oh, they add those trucks now. They're going to have them stopped in a second, yeah. They're at the airfield in Sandy. Oh, nice. Good. So yeah, if you head down there, then you could right, finish well, off your report. Okay, that works. I appreciate the backup. Yo, no problem, man. All right, you have a good one. Yep, you too. Thanks. Stay safe. You too. All right. I'm glad we found him. That was that was nighttime too. I was gonna say daytime, and I'm like, that doesn't make any sense. Um, yeah, that was good. So they got the trucks uh, stopped somewhere. Monkey 24, we're gonna be clear at zero zero nine. Roger, Monkey 24, be advised your Boeing has just come back from a hit. Apparently, all vehicles are right next to the Sandy Shores Airfield gas station 277 Panorama Drive. I have four to five units that are currently on scene for that. Copy. They should be clear then to handle it. They're uh, going to be wanted for assault, uh, and it's going to be upgraded to a murder now since the su subject has died. Lincoln four three four. He's spraying gas. He's spraying like spray gasoline on the ground and light it. Oh, they're going suicidal. I was going to end it, but I might want to go out to that. Shit. Damn it! I'm going to go. I'll get there in a minute. Might as well. Yeah, I gotta see the resolution of this. If he's going spray gas on the ground and then light it on fire, let's see what we got going on. Out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Okay, they're holding the air since I think they're gonna go for takedowns right now. I'm going through all my gas, dude. What the hell? This is great. Damn, we are ripping it, dude. <laughs> I love it. In the Vic. So they're going to be at the airfield. I'm going to take the second exit once we get into the 13 here. Damn, he came out of nowhere. Where did my headlights go? How's that even a thing? 
<laughs> still a signal 100, which means something's still going on. They do not have situational control right now. So we're gonna see if we can try to help out. We're maybe a minute and 30 out. We just need people to move out of the way. Still up. Come on, we can get down there. We can do this. We can do this. Okay, we're getting off the highway. I wasn't gonna make it. This fucking snow, bro. <laughs> okay, we're off the highway right now. This is where it should be going down. The truck should be over here somewhere. I believe they were doing some jank shit, but I don't know where. Oh, wow. 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 Holy shit, they got guns drawn. Oh yeah, that's a code 5. What's up with that siren, dude? How is that different? How is that even different? One King 24, you could show me on scene at 277. They got guns drawn and subjects not cooperating. Subject in the red, white, and blue truck has gotten out of the vehicle. Oh, is he gonna pick up snowballs? He is. They ditched a body on uh, the shore. Ahead, roll the windows down, take the keys out, and put them on top of the truck. We have an independent witness stating that they have murdered someone, ditched their body, and now we have... I'm gonna get to a better position. Driver of the black truck, roll the windows down, turn the engine off, put the keys on top of the truck. I don't- Oh, I see them. They're by the truck over there. Your seat belt and open the door from the outside. Keep it your hand oh, you know what? Sight. I think the other two trucks are not involved. I think they all are. Monkey 24 Dispatch, just to confirm, you said all the trucks were involved in the homicide, right? Monkey 24, uh, one- They're taking off. Uh, the most likely associate. 10-4, they're taking off. Uh, secondary update. Okay, subjects taking off from the police. This is gonna be hell on earth with three trucks. The three trucks, dude. What? His door is open. One truck's out, one truck's out. Show me your hands now. Ah. Hands up. Show me your hands. Uh, I've got tasers. You got lethal. Dude, you better cooperate. I got cover. Yeah, I got lethal. Come on, dude, put him up. This guy couldn't make it that far. He crashed into a fucking. Area. Careful in case they circle back, dude. There, there you go. All right, sorry, sorry. Here hey, let's quickly get him in custody so we don't have a circle back issue where they hit us all. You guys are still clear. Oh, man, you gotta hit me, man! 22. Lucky 24109. I mean, I didn't do nothing. Look at me. I'm all tore up and fell out of my truck. Hey, cool, man. 10-4, we're clear to go for spike strips. We've got 110-15 here at the corner of 305. Roger, 305, 10-15. 314. All right, y'all good? Uh, you're, uh, yeah, we're good. All right. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to try to help him with that. Good job. All right, we're bouncing. Let's see what we got. Did he say Calafia? Westbound Calafia? 
call out. We're still chasing two of the trucks heading west on Calafia Road. Yeah, Calafia. Okay, so they must have went through Grapeseed. I think they went through Grapeseed. Um, that's how they're going through westbound right now. I'm going to try to get on the other side. They're probably going to go through... The bridge at 177 on North Calafia. Hold on. Oh, no. They went Stab City. Just Interesting. The left on the dirt road where, uh, parallels uh, Cassidy Creek. Parallels Cassidy Creek. Okay. I know where they're going. But why? Why are they going Cassidy out that way? Right. Good, I'm good. Go on. Very tight here. My vehicle is too damaged. Okay, we got one officer's vehicle that's two damaged secondaries and I have to take over his primary to try to keep up in it. We got myself and I think another unit trying to catch up. I do not have eyes in their primary. Okay, our, our unit's coming out right now. Primary does not. Okay, uh, we're good. Air unit down, has dude. it. Good shit. Little extreme for our conditions. Uh, we're gonna have those uh, both gonna be westbound. Uh, we're gonna be coming out to the 13 in a few minutes here. They're going out to the freeway. I'm gonna take this left hook up here, which is where they went. They were gonna go over the bridge, but I think one of their vehicles was too damaged. Yeah, I'm trying, bro. Okay, there's two units behind him. I gotta get through Cassidy. Cassidy leads to Beaver when it goes over that little metallic, uh, the metal bridge there. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We're good, we're good. Beaver Trail's coming up here. Beaver Trail's coming up. Should be coming out onto the GOH in about 30 seconds. I'm gonna 22 all this back damage since. Oh god. Oh god. I'm not too far back. Honestly, I'm really not too far back. Um, I'm probably like two miles out. They're gonna try to get some tire shots going up here. This is horrible for this Vic. This road is just horrible. I'm on Cassidy, but it still kind of pop, pops up at uh, Beaver Trail there, so I should be relatively good to kind of get back in it. I'm sliding around too. It's like he's commentating me. Ain't that about a bitch? I am going. Oh no, I'm gonna be on the southbound GOH. Okay, I hear them all. Oh, I'm like right there. I'm surprised I got through it that quick. He got around him. Dude, hiker, get the fuck out of the way, bro. Okay, they're gonna be right back there. There was a lot of One units. Truck in tunnel, two trucks in tunnel, both stop down the Okay, we're on the road. Entering the tunnel. Damn, they must be down there, dude. I am far back. At least we're helping where we can. We got one of them. I was a third unit on that first guy that we got. Luckily, we were able to help out with that. He was giving up, though. Continuing around to the other side. Oh, they're doing the bullshit tunnel trick in that tunnel. Oh my god. You've got to be shitting me. Roger, sorry, can you confirm that was two abandoned trucks? They did the tunnel trick. Are we any units any suspicious activity in vehicles entering or leaving there? I'm locking it oh, down. Dude, that's a negative. I want to. Uh, I was sat in here and I didn't see any suspicious vehicles. It most likely went back up to Pluto. But. Yep, yeah, they're gone. If they're in a stolen vehicle that quick, it's done. Can we we ain't finding them. That's a bitch, dude. That is really a bitch. I thought we would have had them right there. But nope. They did the tunnel trick. Fucking created that shit one day and then it has trickled down to us losing suspects from something that we created. Oh, fuck. Isn't that shitty? Uh, 
be That's a it. I mean, they're done zone now. Air, like uh, in a good way, they just were able to pretty much evade the police. Unless we see a uh, times two occupied vehicle, which might be possible. That would only be it. So I don't know. I really couldn't tell you. That's that's a bummer. I thought we were gonna be able to get back out there and kind of help out really quick. Hell no. We probably passed them. Airbud one. I'm headed north. That's a bitch. Well, Gate 24, since we've lost eyes on the individual, let's go ahead and lift the air. If anyone sees anything that might correlate or the individuals themselves, just go ahead and call it out. Okay, we just lifted the air. Unfortunately, we lost them. They were able to get in a vehicle and pretty much sneak out the back end. I mean, if you can do the tunnel trick and it works, good shit. The airspace was pretty congested right there, too, because it's a military base, so it's not like the police helicopter could really go to that tunnel. Uh, so that, they knew what they were doing from the get-go, so I guess it worked. Uh, but that is going to be where we wrap this one up, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all so much for coming out and watching this episode of DOJRP. And we will see you next video.